Welcome to the video tutorials of the book Methods, Evaluation and Research in Education by Muhammad Attaruzzaman. And today we are going to learn how to write research journal conference paper or article using templates in Microsoft Word 2007 or later versions. Sometimes it may happen at the time of writing research paper that a researcher has to pay much attention to writing style, font size, spacing, reference technique and many other things rather than concentrating on his actual work. Do you know that almost all of the internationally recognized journals are providing templates? Now, the question is, what is a template? Templates are nothing but a standard of writing papers. In this tutorial, we will see two types of templates, macro-enabled template from the Springer and simple template from the IEEE. And more importantly, we will see how to use these templates efficiently in writing journal or conference papers. You can download these templates from the respective websites or simply by searching in the Google. For your practice, two sample templates are included in the DVD. However, you should keep in mind that the templates vary from journal to journal. For example, the templates for IEEE may not be the same as Springer. Let's start with the macro enabled template. By clicking the icon, it will be opened in the Microsoft Word format with some extra features and a security warning. Now, click on the Options button and select Enable this content. The security warning has disappeared. The extra feature we are talking about is an additional menu Lecture Note Macros and its submenus are Title, Author, Address, Email, Abstract, Keywords and many more. Let's start writing a research paper. Click the title icon and write the title of the paper. For example, ICT to enhance learning. Press enter. Click the author icon and write the author name of the paper. For example, write Muhammad Attaruzzaman and then write Shah Jahan Tapan. Press enter. Now, click on address icon and write Department of Instructor Training and General Studies. Now, press enter. And then again, write Islamic University of Technology, Dhaka, Bangladesh. Now, press enter. Click the email icon and write Akhtar, comma, SM Tapan. And also write at iut-dhaka.edu. Now, Press enter. After you finished, click the abstract button and then write the text. However, to save time, copy the portion of text which you want to write as an abstract of the paper and paste it. OK, look at the back icon at the bottom corner of the paragraph. Click on it and select Match Destination Formatting. Let's see the changes at the screen. Now, click the keywords icon and write learning, then e-learning and ICT in capital and ICT. Yeah. Press enter. Now, click the H1 icon which is in fact heading 1 and write introduction and then press enter. Now, write the text. To save time, Copy the portion of text you want to include and then paste it. Let us copy it and now paste it. Okay. Look at the bag icon again at the bottom corner of the paragraph. Click on it and see there is no option like match destination formatting. So, what we have to do now? Just select the whole text and click the H3 or H4 icon. Select it. And now click the H3 or H4 icon. See the changes at the screen. Now, change the bold portion of the text 
in case of H3 and italic portion in case of H4. Now, you want to write the second heading of the paper and its subheading. Click on the H1 icon for the second heading and write background. For example, let's write background. Yeah, and now press enter. Now, click on H2 icon and write the subheading of the second heading. History of ICT, for example. Press enter and write the normal text. You can also insert image, caption figure, table, footnotes and many more things as per need. One of the most important things in writing research, proposal, report and paper is bibliography or references. In MS Word 2007, one can write the bibliography or references easily. Let's see how it can be done. Go to Reference menu. Now, select the style of writing reference as APA, American Psychological Association. Click the icon Manage Sources and then New. See the Create Source window at the screen. Select the type of source as Book. For example, in case of author name, click the edit button and write best as last name, okay, and John as first name, and W dot as middle name, and then click add button. If you have more than one writer, then repeat the process. Now, write the title of the book, for example, Educational Research, then Year of Publishing 2010, then City from where the book is published, just like, for example, New Delhi, and Publisher, Princess Hall, India Limited. Okay, done. These are the mandatory fields for writing references, but if you want to provide additional information, for example, edition of the book then select the option show all bibliography fields and write second at the edition field just write it okay click OK see the preview in APA format at the bottom of the source manager window look at the citation and bibliography format here insert citation in the body section of the journal paper by clicking the icon insert citation as per need suppose you are at the end of writing a journal paper definitely you have to write the references now so click h1 icon and write bibliography press enter now write the bibliography in the reference section by clicking bibliography icon and then finally insert bibliography Okay. The template we will be exploring now is simple template from the IEEE and it is nothing but the use of copy and paste. Just see the two papers at the screen. The first one is just a simple paper which is to be converted to the IEEE standard. And now the second one is the IEEE template downloaded from the IEEE.org website. Let's start the conversion from simple paper to IEEE standard. Copy the title of your paper and paste it in the title portion of the template. Click the box icon at the lower right corner and select Match Destination Formatting. Remove the bullet from the beginning. Now, copy the abstract of your paper, yeah, copy it, and paste it in the abstract portion of the template. Just paste it. Click the box icon at the lower right corner and select Match Destination Formatting. Remember, always keep the first word of any section of a template intact during pasting, otherwise, Match Destination Formatting will not appear 
at the back icon. You can easily remove the word after pasting. Now, copy the introduction of your paper and paste copy portion to the rest of the template's introduction. Click the box icon at the lower right corner and select Match Destination Formatting. Do some adjustments manually. You can also insert image, caption figure, table, footnotes and many more things as per need. Let's see how it can be done. Now, copy the reference of your paper. Keep the first word GO intact and paste copy portion to the rest of the template's reference. Now, click the box icon and select Match Destination Formatting. Now, just remove the word GO and do some adjustments manually. Just see the numbering is done twice for each reference. Remove to second one from each. Is it not easy? I think it's more than easy. So, from now on, you should not have any concern about writing the research, journal, conference papers. Thank you for staying with us. It's Yasdani saying you goodbye.